Good morning, everybody, and once again, welcome back in today's class. Day number 10. Wow. How how fast the time is going on. Oh, yeah. And we did not complete even 10% of slippers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but no worries. As I say, we will we will do definitely. Time taking, but next week is going to be a good one. So today we are going to be start with a new topic called the table. Okay. You book a table in a restaurant for the four people, five people, six people. Table is a collection of row and column. Table is something which store the data in itself. Anything which you are able to see in service now. It's coming from table. You want to see? Let go here. It is a table. Rows and columns. Right? It is a table. Now the thing is that why these tables are required and what is the importance of this table okay because as i say if you want to be store anything in the database then we need some mechanism and service now provide the table as a format but to understand the table structure Let's understand the the types. Service now mainly says two type of table base and core. My religion, my surname, I'm getting from the from my base. My parents of parents of parents of parents of parents of parents of parents. Everybody using the same surname that is a base. One of the first person in my family who started this family using this name from there till now we are just getting the same surname. There is a base. It is not given by anybody else. Definitely, yes, God is a superpower here. We as a human being, we as a lot of lot of things matter, but keep aside everything just to say this, understand simply in this manner. There is a base which don't have any parent table, which is not extended from any other table. What does this mean here extended? My father was in a business. I grown up, completed my degree, graduation, post graduation. I done this part. He says, why not you, you support me in my business? I said, no, you do your business. But I will extend your business. I'll take a base from you. And will extend it. That is the purpose of the extended as well. Base means I'm getting a good reputation in the market. I'm getting the contacts or the clients. I'm getting a little bit financial support. It's called the extended. Because you already set up a base. OK, core means a table which can be a base. But has been extended. Let's let's understand this in a service now word. Base because I don't want to put any other word here. Code tables in service now. See. Base table are more like a parent table. 
from which other tables are extended. Who am I? Who are you? Who is Elijah? Who is Vikas? Sorry, Sahil. Who is Arnab? We are the extended part of our family. Tomorrow when you get married, you have a baby, you have a kid, then that is extended part of your family. This is what the base. So these table help me. To create a new table. And we inherit the properties from here. Like if I say that Anav is a good boy. His hobbies or he's very silent in a lot of time. Then people say, no, no, his father is also in the same nature. It means he is, is inheriting the, the thoughts. He is inheriting the nature from his father. This is what the mean here. Task is a base table. Task is a base table. What is the task here? This is the table which is given by service now and the whole industry working on this. Like if I say. In in the ice creams, what is the base flavor? Anybody know? What do you think in the ice cream? What is the base flavor? Milk, strawberry. No, not a base base flavor. Which has no taste, no color, but still people use that. Milk. Milk. Vanilla. Vanilla. Milk. Vanilla is kind of a base. You mix vanilla and chocolate, you can make something else. Mix it's vanilla in the cold drink, you can make something else. Put vanilla in in some pudding and all, you can make in something else. So that is a base. That vanilla has some something in it. Its color is white. Taste is little sweet and all the things will be there. In the same manner, the task table is a table which contain a basic information to run a business. To run this, this modules. Then what is core? A base table can be a core table as well. A base table can be a core table as well. Let's let's understand a little bit more here. So CMDB CI is a core table, but not a base table. Now you cannot say Atul, I'm not getting these points because you have to be understand these things. You are actually going to be entering the service now world. Till the time last from three, four days, we are just doing the time pass. OK, this, 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 this. But now these are basics which are required. See. Any table that exists by default in the baseline. A base table is a core table as well. But a core table. Is a base or not that is not be required. In simple meaning, base table means a, any table that is a parent table, but is not a child table of any other table. Means it itself is a parent, but it don't have any parent on the on the on its job. That is called the base table. Core table. As it said, if you see any table that exists by default in the baseline system. When when we get service now instance, we get a lot of tables. Those are the core tables. 
if you delete those tables, your work will get impacted. Those are the code tables. Code table can have a parent as well. Like if I open the stars table, you will not find any any parent. But if I open the CMDB underscore CI table, you will find a parent for this one and call the CMDB. Now adding one more. Two more. Custom table. Custom table is a table which is created by a user in the global scope. My father says, hey, why don't you support me in my business? Come on, I'm not going to be supporting you. I'll create my own business without your support. Custom table. Means I'm not taking anything from my family. From my roots. This is what the custom table. In service now custom table always start with the U underscore. Or someone say. User, user defined table. Last. Not expanded. Scope table. Which you create for a specific scoping purpose. These tables start with. Hello. Yes. Are custom and scope tables um, base tables? No. Nah. Custom table cannot be can never be a base table. So that's another type of table. Yes. So it is like this. One, two, three, and four. Okay. Okay. So these four type of tables are there. Now let's understand where these tables are stored. System definition. Tables. From where these information is coming, this is coming from this table. Sys DB object. Sys DB object. Okay. So in this particular table, service now store every table. Now I will show you the task table. This is a base table because it has no parent on the top. Extend means is 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 it getting extended from any other table? No. That is it is called the base table. Now if I show you this CMDP underscore CI. See this one. This is a core table. Why? Because it has been extended from the base configuration item table. And what is extensible? I am building a business without support of my family. And I want my Kids also use that particular. Business. To extend or to work or to earn their. livelihood, so I can make it as extensible. Tick box, ah, you can use it, no problem. 
like every parent says, yes, you can use it. If you want, you can use this this property. You can use this money and all the things. I'm saying extensible is true. Yes, you can use. If I say no, then you cannot use. This is what the base and the code table. Now let's open task table. This. This is my task table. And as I said, that every table or every object, like Arnav has some attributes name, color, religion, education, qualification, salary, job, designation, bank balance, hobby, property. These are the attributes of Arnav. Same manner, this task table has a dictionary entries, attributes. As I say, service now called as a dictionary entry. We call it as a field, we call it as an attribute, but service now called this as a dictionary entry. And in the task table, I am getting these many fields. Activity, activity, additional approval, assigned to assignment group, so if I go here, uh, is it and underscore? Okay. Incident. Okay, like this assignment group. See, it is coming from the task table. Why? Because this incident table has been extended from the task table. So I'm getting everything from my parents. Let's say Arnav is getting married. Okay. His wife, or I can say his in-laws, give some gift to his wife. Maybe a, a mobile phone. Let's say example a mobile phone. Okay. She came to home. Anna thought, let me let me give a new mobile phone to my wife. She said, no, don't give. My parents gave me a just new one. This is what? This thing. Why you want to create a new field of the assignment group when it is coming from the task table? That is the reason you can see. If you see this, there's a lot of fields which is coming from the task table. Let's say impact. See from the task table. Channel, not from the task table. Oh, it's from the task table. So this is the benefit of using extended. Definitely, if sim simple example, if my father is in the business and that business is going very well, and if I join that business, I'm getting the benefit only. I can extend the business. I don't need to be start from the base or from the zero. Right? So this is what the stuff says here. Now let's create a table. Yeah. 
service now recommend creating custom table in the scoped application means if you want to work on the custom tables then better you do the scoping application scope part but it is our practice so we are able to we are going to do in this particular area only i'll put batch 13 lng it is a label tab out it is starting with the u why because this table is getting created by me as a user not given by the system not given by the system so it is be coming as a this thing as a u now do you want to extend it one more thing once a table get created you cannot extend it after that means once i'll submit it's done i cannot go back and say no 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 i want to be open this i want to be add this particular or i want to be extend it from this you cannot extend but yes you can add field and all you all the things you can add it that's fine but you cannot extend it again clear yahan tak any doubt yeah atul can you repeat the last point again when you mentioned you cannot extend so once i submit this mm -hmm. i cannot modify and make this table extended ah these decision need to be take on the day one not after that right if it submit if it submit mm -hmm. okay so so the table name that you will mention here mm -hmm. so you will basically be inheriting property from that table that you will be mentioning here right yes i'll mm -hmm. i'll show the example so let's extend from the task table Mm -hmm. right okay it says do you want to create a module these options you want to create like this ha ha and why not do you want to create a mobile module means you want to use this on the mobile as well i said yes as of now i can say yes add module to the menu what the menu what this application name you want to give i want to give application name learn grow together and now i'm going to save this it's done this is read only now hmm nobody can change even i can i am an admin but still i cannot change it mm -hmm. atul banga table yes table is ready now let's come here and see this is my menu this is my module atul yes please while you are creating the table the part where it says name that you put um for the custom part that you put u underscore yeah is it mandatory you put the u underscore it will come automatically okay it is service now scripting service now logic okay. otherwise there is a no way to find out that which table is created by a user which is given by service now so it is as a u clear alisa yeah i have another question which is so when creating that table can it also be like an application 
Is there also an application? Because you created the module. Yes. Your question, I'm, I'm not getting completely. So the table you created is also an application. Yes. Yes, uh, correct, correct, correct. By default, it will create. Let me show you here. S13. Okay. This. So by default, I say create a module. A module get created. I have to go to modules level. So it will create a module. Let me open this. This one, this is the module. Which get created out of the box, not out of the box. When we click on OK, because we say tick box. Yes, I want a module and service now pick up table name. Or the title as a as a sorry label as a module name. So it get created automatically and by default it put S so we can remove as from here and say and it is coming from the table called batch underscore th batch 13 underscore lng and if you open this this is coming from the table which we just created so now if i come back here on the tables I'll search from here. U underscore. This one. Now, did you notice one thing? Let me open one more table in the parallel to show. Uh -huh. Let me open this. And let me open this. This task table, how many fields? How many? Seventy. Seventy. Yeah, seventy. And this table, how many fields? Seventy-one. Why extra? Why extra? Uh, for backup. For oh, for backup. For what backup, my friend? For what backup? Let me show you. Now the first question come in your mind. Atul, you are working service now for a long time. Okay. That's fine. You know the things, but how we will know that in this 71 fields, how many are coming from the task table and how many is the other than task table? Because there's a difference of one. That's true. Means 70 fields it copied from task. But one field it did not copy from task. Then something is there. So let me do one thing. Let me come here and add a field called the table.
and now you can see task 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 okay task 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 okay the task task means up to this everything is coming from the task table okay okay and this is not from the task table sys id sys id what is sys id what is sys id guys you need key for a particular record in service now for a particular record yeah hmm okay <clears throat> but it will record up for every column as well for every attribute as well yeah good good yeah i think for every attribute yeah what yeah for every for every what every record every column every table every instance what is the side of this particular table can tell me Sys I ID of table yeah, is at the last, right? Here. Yeah, there. It is a combination of 32 character alphanumeric. How this get generated? Now I'm I'm sure Eliza, Arnab and Sahil is going to be say one thing. Atul, this is a cheating. We are here for a training and you're taking our test. The homework for you. To find out how this sys ID get generated. Because I say in the beginning when we started this, this knowledge sharing session. Everything which you see in service now is a configuration. There is, a, there is a nothing which come come go out from the top and say, okay, let's do this. The read by system agree. Unique ID agree. But how this unique ID get generated? Not saying you need to be telling me the 100% formula. But give me some clue that how this get generated. Okay, so now this is the sys ID of this particular table. And this is the new attribute or the dictionary entry has been added here by service now. Automatically. Now let's take another example. Let's get a new table. LNG, I know. And I say not use the same menu, learn and grow together. I don't want to get a new menu. Okay. I click on the save. No extended. Now tell me how many fields it will give. Six. Why? We did not extend it. We did not extend it. It. Still, I got a six field, six attributes, six dictionary entries. Yeah, I think those are provided out of box, right? By service now, those fields. Mm. Table. Yes. Who created? When created? Sys ID. Who update? What updates? What updated? And who updated? 
these are the six fields if you extend any table if you do not extend the any table these will get created automatically and now if you go here you will see the two modules see which is coming from my table which is coming from your table now let's create field <clears throat> or dictionary entry in our table insert a new row you can do it from here if you want or you can click on here chalo yahan se leke chalte hain easy hai new what type of field you want attribute data type what type we have we have these many types these many types i want color favorite color and see this also created with the help of you maybe i'm creating a application where i want to be ask a user which is your favorite color so i need a field i need a attribute which help me to get that information from the user right clear yeah okay so i am creating it you want to make it read only want to make it mandatory you want to display you can do it i put mandatory let, let me come very clearly here what is your homework for this weekend create minimum five new tables in my instance minimum for everybody minimum hai try to extend those tables from any other table maybe task maybe cmdb maybe sla try to find out number 1 number 2 in this five table create two or three more tables which you are not going to be extend from any other table but create a field with your choice date field check box radio button because now either you are working as a admin either you are working as a consultant either you are working as a developer or either you are working as a business analyst these basic stuffs are required for a complete hands on understanding you cannot say i don't know that how to create a table or how to get a field no it's not expected from you you work any level in service now any any decision service now but these are the basic you have to be know that is an important point i need minimum 7 8 10 tables at least from everybody so oh, i'm coming here created yes created chalo save atul very good this is my table this is my module so let's go here learn and grow batch 30 are from where these fields are coming yes aliza from where these fields are coming atul hi how i know and you are sharing your knowledge how i know you what what no question asking me chalo let's forget come here new are wow that is so beautiful form is ready but who created this form and did you create this form 
Yeah, yeah, I think mean, that's created by default, right? Who created it? System. Yep. Yeah. Same thing. I I work. My my only thing is that I work on basics on the roots. System. No. How system will know that I have to be create this particular form? Did you tell system? Did I tell system? A BA is the one, a consultant is the one who understand the pain area, background of the particular stuff. I tell you one, one example. In my family, someone is facing some problem in eye. Okay, she's not able to see from one eye completely. Okay, so we went to a doctor. He said that He's, he's a very good doctor of eye specialist. I respect him very much. OK, he said that now you're getting age as well. You are diabetic as well. So it happens that you are. This vision is getting zero or worse now and soon you will not able to see it, but you can keep these eye drops every day. It will keep your eye healthy. And for a little bit more time, your vision will be continue. OK that my relative call my my mom because definitely now they are in a in an age of 60s 70s so they discuss each and everything okay then my mom says okay why don't you come to our hometown we have a good doctor here they came to our hometown we take them to a doctor and that time i was also there the doctor asked a question okay when you know that you are having this problem, how you identify that this you have this problem? So my lady started explaining that part. Two years back, I was just sitting, I was doing the swing work, but I'm not able to see that needle and putting the thread in that. Okay. Before that, any other issue? I have some diabetic, I got some migraine as well, but it's worked fine. And the doctor says, OK, I got at your point that OK, you're not your vision is not good. But let's understand that in our body. There are the three components which help a eye to get a vision. Number one, a eye itself. Number two, there's a nerve going from the brain to that eye. And number three, near to eye, there's another stuff which is helping eye to get the vision. The earlier doctor check only one part. But this doctor asked my relative to let's murder the other two parts as well, and then we'll start the actual treatment. This is what a BA need to be do. You are saying it's created by system, but who tell the system? Nobody tell the system. This is what the another thing when we get the extended table. Because when you extend when when you were four five or three year old people told you told your parents hey anavis look like his his father no 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 anavis look like his his like mother because due to this extension service now say okay you're extending me no problem you are sending the table I can give you the default form as well, which has been built on this particular table. So I give to you. But now Arnav is confused. Atul, we don't want this table. Sorry, we don't want this field. We want our field. I'm able to link this this dots. Are you are you clear on that part? One of my one of my friend who uh, not my friend, but he became my friend who attended the training from me. He says that whenever I want to listen to the good stories, I start your training sessions. Because you you join the dots. My intention is not to do the spoon feeding here. My intention that Arnab, Sahil and Eliza think 
that why this form is coming and this is what a ba do why this is becoming from where this is becoming so as we extended this it is becoming like that if you click on the new let, let's open your table right now okay are kahan gaya right now yaar did you save or not ha ah, we we save yes, yes, yes. here okay why for your case only one field is coming when i click on the new why it's not showing anything yeah because it did not extend to any table right so it come on system, oh. but it has a field right but the yeah, system doesn't know how how to present it right um for extension they already knew so they they but, knew how the previous form looked like but my 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 friend we have a field on your table as well right agree right it should show something here yeah so, something that why did not showing it didn't yeah something we need to take i guess to make it display yeah yeah nahi 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 because the six field which is available on your table are not required oh. for a user to enter Right. those are calculated fields right not calculated those are the taking the value from your action solely let me show you click on the submit record generated want to see the other six fields let me show you right right so system says that do, no, why you want to put this field on the on the form yeah when i have a capability in the background to capture the value automatically right 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 so this is what it do so basically if we had created i mean on mm -hmm. our own then one field for that table it would have shown then right yes mm. Oh, sorry yes now the question come atul what happened to our attribute which we just created right mm -hmm. this is what this is the form view agree right now i have to be edit this as well this thing i'll pick up on monday but before that let me show you one thing the question still remain in my mind when i click on this why this page is getting opened right and up mm -hmm. there must be some logic right. some configuration written somewhere so this is called the link type come here click on this pencil icon mm -hmm. this is my module right right i want to change this i can change so to guess ko aise rakhte hai batch 13 ke naam se rakhte hai it is easy to identify You want to put order number. Order number hundred. Order is a very, very, very important attribute of the dictionary entry in service now. Hint. Hello, this is my module. Whenever we create a table, service now create a role for the table automatically. you want to see let me show you where we are see if you scroll down see.
service now created these three roles, four roles. One role for the four operations and this operation called the CURD, C U R D. Create, update, read and delete. Because they know that to control your your what I can say. Table you need some access. So what we do, what we do as a user, what we do as an admin, if I'm creating 10 tables in my service now, then I will get 10 custom role as well. And those are considered as a customization. So what we do, we remove this role. We say no, 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 let's use service now standard role only. And what is that? I want to use the admin role to access this table. Do you keep the mobile phone boxes? Once mobile phone get open or laptop boxes. No, because it is unnecessary burden for me to keep maintenance. Right? Yeah, right. right. So I said no, no, I don't want to maintain it for a long time. Better I use the out of the box. Huh? Throw it because I have a stand in my in my house. I can keep my mobile charging on there. I don't want to use this box. And now here the magic come. link type. List of record. Total 10 or 12 link types are there. Another homework. When you create those five or seven new tables, create different different modules under that. Minimum four or five modules in each table. And put the different link type on that. List of record is this thing. This is the list of record. I want to open a form for the new record. And save it. Go here. This is the magic here. No, no, Atul, I don't want this thing. I want to be search something. Okay, no problem. Come here. Search screen. Save. Search. See, search button. Don't get confused. It is a form. No, it is not a form. It is a search button. No, no, Atul, I want something more. I want the map. Where is the map? Here. Which map you want? All locations. See. You open your mobile phone, open the taxi or the or that particular uh, cab provider and search on the map. This is what it done in the background. See. So this magic is coming the the purpose that how this particular module will get open is decided by the link type. Few link types have a argument sorry argument uh, argument as a parameter as well. Now try each and every part. If you understand, good. If you don't understand, leave it. Like HTML, you can leave it. Scripts, you can leave it. URL, you can leave it. But rest, you can try it. That what this particular thing do. This is what make the module on the page. That how a module will be look like. <laughs> Clear, okay? Everybody. 
yes okay and what is your other homework go to user admin okay tables and search for the sys underscore user table mm -hmm. this and read its column its attribute read it because we already created the users you can see all these fields now you able to understand that from where these fields are coming what this field contain user table group table role table incident table task table change table problem table these are the basic tables which you know by heart in, in i'm i'm uh, not sure elisa you can understand but i can translate it for you in hindi there is a saying there is a song ye ishq nahi aasa bas itna samajh lijiye the similar that this love is not that much easy just understand in the same manner the service now is not that much easy the actual thing is started now the actual thing is started just now monday you will come with like a lot of headache or confusion atul no it's too tough to be understand but we have to be do gradually that is that is as i said in the today's class beginning last standard it was a time pass you were very happy oh that is so much easy service now i can understand i can understand but now the next 20 days is going to be hard because we are going to be work on the actual stuff okay more you deep dive more you learn that will be more good for you any question and definitely guys happy weekend to hai tell me guys any doubt any question uh no atul yeah but we we need to as you said yeah yes we need dive ourselves and find out and then yeah obviously if you need any you know i'm the person and then we need to check it out so right a lot of stuff has been done this week so we need to test it out there. Yes. Elisa, any question from your side? Sahil. No, I'll just rewatch the video and yes, do my homework. But um, out of that, I have a random question which I might need to take us back a little. Give me a minute. Let, let me let me stop the recording and then we can pick that up. Okay. So, um, there was. I know I would I would still have to watch all the videos. Mm -hmm. But if you could just show me, so there was a part where you taught us how instead of staying on the same tab, if we probably open like an application or something, how we can extend it to a new tab while remaining on that same place. Like this, I'm doing. Yes, exactly. Nothing. So I go there. I press Control and do the right click. i i go here i press control key on my laptop and okay. just click the mouse okay or you can do like this as well open the new tab okay all right perfect yeah okay good chaliye so let's stop the recording here guys and we'll take a quick attendance now